Hi folks, I thought I'd show you how an electric manifold heater works. This is the new plug. Fuel line goes on there, 12 volts go there, and if you look inside, there's a coil, an electric coil that heats up red hot, and when that gets hot, a little valve opens inside and allows fuel to go in and start a little fire. And that screws right into the intake manifold. So when you use that, it starts a little fire inside the manifold and heats the air up, and that gives you a lot better cold starting. That works a lot better than ether, if you ask me. Most of the Perkins engines all have this plug in the manifold, even the large six-cylinder engines. I just put one of these plugs and systems onto a 2640 Massey. It'll also work in a white 285 or 2105. So I've got one set up here in the vise. And some of the models also use this little reservoir. And so the feed from the injector return lines goes into this port. This port goes down to the plug and this port up here loops around and goes back down to uh, to your fuel supply or up to the tank return. So, let's see. Should start getting hot. There it's glowing. Then the fuel should come to it. Such a simple little device, but works so well. I've put these on a few different tractors now that never had them. Some guys would like to use their loader tractor and don't want to wait two hours for it to warm up with the block heater. So with this little unit, you just hold it for 30 seconds or so, and then keep holding the button, or if it's on your key switch, Sometimes you can crank and heat at the same time. So it's worth a shot. If you have any questions, just send me a message. Thanks.